British shooting show. Here we are with an old friend of mine. So this is weird. I interview you. You don't interview me. How you been? How I've you been? You. I've missed you. I've missed you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've missed you. I've got a bigger scope now, so I won't next time. How have you been? What have you been up to? Um, so far, 2019 has actually been quite quiet. The back end of last year was very hectic. I yeah. was, um, it bounced from Finland to Slovenia to Sweden, and that was my family didn't see me basically. But it was great fun because. We did so much. The, the, the variety was um, was just there from moose in, in Finland to chamois in Slovenia. And, wow! Uh, it was, it was, you know, I do, I do have a, a fantastic job, but it's um, it's tiring. It's tiring. No, but, I understand. But also, when I do film with people, I film with people I like most of the time. It's just a dig. That was just most a time. dig. Now, you are getting about a bit. I read that in a toilet somewhere. Let's see how we know. <laughs> now you are getting about, every time I phone you, you're always off somewhere very, very low flash and always very, very nice. What you got planned for this year? Have you got anything really super coming up? Um, Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan. Well, One of my favourites. Did you say again? Azerbaijan. That's right. Okay. So Azerbaijan, so that Thank is... Thank you. Uh, and possibly Pakistan. I can say that one. Can say that I one. can do that one. Pakistan, see? No, that's so really that, good. That's... What are you doing out there? What's Pakistan? No, no, they're still... Don't know yet. That, that, okay. is, that is a potential because... It's actually quite interesting. A lot of um, countries are looking at taking driven pheasant, for example, right. and implementing it in quite exotic locations. Wow! So making it available to Middle East or, or you know, stands or, or whatever. So there's a. It's really interesting that that is sort of a migration that's happening. But I think there's a lot of sort of possible expertise that will then be taken abroad uh, to establish these sort of shoots as well. Fantastic. But, but also. Um, uh, big game as well. So uh, Pakistan, I think, has very big four. I think they're trying to sort of try and get. I don't know. It's sort of. It's really interesting how you get the normal places that you go and hunt, but there's, you know the more exotic places are definitely coming to the fore. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see how that fantastic. Develops, actually. Brilliant. Oh, well, that sounds like you've got a busy old schedule then. I have, I have, I have, and then the normal stuff going to Scotland and um, and Europe. So so no, it's it's. Yeah, it's really exciting, and yeah, I don't. It, what's great is I don't really know what's going to happen this year. You know, yeah. where we, we go out and um, and look at the projects, and we come up with story ideas. You know, really now and Ewa, which is the big trade show in Nuremberg in a few weeks' time. That's when we sit down and talk to the brands and sort of come up with the concepts. And, oh, you know, that's where you do it. So you go around and you hit them up there and say, right, yeah, listen, this is what we're going to do. Like, yeah, yeah. Some ideas. You know, things like you and the life of a deer. Do we then do? I mean, I want to be more with Paul. Do we end up doing you and the life of Chinese water deer? Because I think that. That sort of takes it as away a little bit from the hunting element and brings in the natural history element. I think people really like that side of it. it Very much so, yeah, yeah. No, it doesn't have to be. It doesn't. You're absolutely right. And a lot of people have said the same thing to me, funny enough. Um, and I think a lot of people that are doing the YouTube stuff and all that, they're, they're, they're going away from just killing stuff. That's the way that it's perceived. It's not. It's wrong, obviously. But the fact is, they're, they're doing the history of. And I think that's a really interesting angle. It's always about the backstory, right? Yeah. Everything's about the backstory. If you haven't got that story to start with, then you shouldn't turn the camera on. You've got to have the reason yeah. why you're doing it, whether it's you know whether it's management or whether it's food or whatever. But yeah. when you have certain stuff on YouTube that is purely about the glory ending of something, I, I agree. Me, I, it, no, it me has, either. It really has no place to be honest. No, no. To totally agree. Totally agree. Whether it's with an air rifle or whether it's with a buffalo rifle, whatever it may be. So. Yeah, I can't hit anything with either of them, so it doesn't matter. Well, I'll tell you what, the old adage you're asking the time to tell you how clock works. Thank you very much indeed. Always a pleasure. Cheers, mate. Okay.